Welcome back to the Vila video tutorial on pitch analysis using pot. My name is Chris. As we left off last time, we opened up our newly imported um, media file and we opened it in the pot viewer window. As you can see, we have the uh, waveform at the top and we have the pitch analysis at the bottom. If you are, do not see a pitch analysis at the bottom, it's because you've added media that's longer than the standard 50 seconds that pod uses to do pitch analysis. You can change this by going to view and show analysis and change this to for example 100 which I've set it to here. Uh, I'd recommend that you pre-select a section of audio no longer than five seconds because as you can see on the pitch analysis at the bottom it's very uh, unorganized and can't really get any information from it. Um, but for now I'll let it stay on 100 so we can see the entire pitch analysis. Press OK. If you have a gray cloudy area behind it, it's the spectrogram and you can remove this as we're focusing on purely pitch analysis for now. Okay. So now if you've already pre-selected a clip that you want to focus on, you can go to select and select and you add your time codes from the media file. So let's say I want to look at from 5 to 8. Press apply. As you can see, I've selected this area. Press OK. If you haven't pre-selected anything, you can also just click and drag where you want to, uh, something you want to select to for further analysis. And um, in the bottom here we have uh, zoom functions where you have zoom to all, you have a step one, a zoom in once, you can zoom out once, but you can also zoom to your selection. And if you press that, as you can see now, we've zoomed, to the, zoomed in to, on our selection and the pitch analysis is already starting to look more organized. Um, this, by the way, is three seconds long. so. I might want to look at an even shorter clip, so I can select this and zoom in even further. And as you can see now, it really starts to paint a picture of how the pitch is actually going in this specific uh, 1.2 uh, second long clip. Okay, for further analysis, I'd recommend that you export this specific section of audio that you want to work with into its own separate uh, audio file, so you don't work with the entire file but you only have your small clip and you do this by select, pressing file and extract selected sounds you can do preserve times which preserves the time um, time slots from the original media file or you can start the new clip from zero um, it's a matter of preference which one you choose I'd select preserve times for now because that's easier to go back to the main file to actually find where it was I originally um, located it um, then I can go back to the pot objects window and you can see here now sound untitled number four the one that's highlighted is the new one I just exported I'd like to rename this so I have an idea of what it is so I'll rename this McCain short clip press apply press OK now we have sound McCain short clip which we can work with in episode 3 where we'll start to segment and annotate our audio thank you for now thank you for now thank you for now thank you for now